Richardson, the long running back, McCarron under center. They hand the ball to Richardson, and he hits the LSU and is pushed back. Wow, there was no place to go. He ran into Sam Montgomery, and he pushed Trent Richardson back to about the... Now waiting on the snap of the football. And McCarron, play action fake in the end zone, wants to throw, has time, throws it way down there, and it is incomplete. Perfectly timed defensively by LSU's Brandon Taylor, intended for Mays. And Richardson in the backfield. There's the snap, McCarron to throw, and he does. I actually... He has it. He, he did not get rid of it. He 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 pumped as if he was going to throw it. Thought better of it. Pulled it back. And Sam Montgomery down it. Is that right? 49 yard. Snap. Place. And the kick is blocked. It's blocked and taken by LSU back to the 30, 40, 45. That is Eric Reed, and he is across midfield and knocked out of bounds at the Alabama 41 yard line. Option has come off. Jefferson runs the option, tosses it out to Ford, turns the corner. He's at the 25, he's at the 30, he's at the 35, and out of bounds up around the 38-yard line. At the 42, three receivers left, one right. Pistol formation, Jefferson with the ball, drops the throw, looks, he's, and he fires way downfield. He's got a man there, he's got it at the 10-yard line. That is Russell Shepard, a great job by Jefferson because he had... Now then, waiting on the snap. There it is, and the kick is up, and boy, he nailed it. He nailed it, and that is the end of the first half of play. Lacey stays in at running back. Lone receiver on the right side. The Karen under center. Play action fake, deep drop. All the time he wants, and he throws, and it is intercepted. Favored, he may go. 25, he's still at the 20. He's at the 15, and down he goes. Outstanding interception by Morris Claiborne, and that's the big break. It's his fourth of the year, and the big break that LSU needed. Over the field at the 20-yard line. Snap, plays, kick. And it's real quiet in here, so that must mean it went through. It's left. Mays is uh, in at quarterback and takes a snap. Now he drops back and wants to throw and throws it towards the end zone. Has a man wide open, and he has got it at the end. Uh, one yard. Oh, it's picked off. It is picked off. It was intended for Williams, and Reed picked it off. From up here, it looked like Williams got his hands on it, but Reed came up with a football at the goal line. Well, Reed backed up. Williams, it was a trick play, as Mays is the one who ended up throwing it out there. And off, uh, Alabama's coming after this. One. Yeah, they are. They got everybody at the line of scrimmage. Mays is back to receive, and there's a. The, oh, what a great punt. Mays back it up, back it up. It goes over his head. Look at this thing. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Inside the 20 and still going. It's down to the 19-yard line. What a punt. 73 yards by Brad Wing. Holy cow. That's the... That's the <laughs> Richardson, the running back. Man in motion, far side. Richardson's got it. And it's tripped up on a great tackle. That is Brandon Taylor, who made a great tackle at the 35-yard line. Shoe line tackle on Trent Richardson on the right side. McCarron hands it to Richardson, and he's going to be thrown for another loss at the 30-yard line. Outstanding. Ron Brooks, a loss of four. Jefferson Anderson drops back in the end zone, and he throws. It is caught by Clemaw, and that is a first down up to the 17-yard line. LSU rolled the dice, and it came up with Ware and Jefferson. There's the snap. Faith Jefferson to throw. In deep trouble. He runs, got running room. 30, 35. He is all the way up to the 38 yard line and has a first down. Great job again by overtime. Tied at six. There's a snap of Karen to throw. Being pressured. He's in the pocket and he is going to go down at the 35 for the win. Alamon. A 25 yard. Alabama will be coming hard for this one. Snap, place, kick in the air. LSU wins. I can tell you for sure now, LSU wins. Alamo with a 25-yard field goal. And in overtime, the LSU Fighting Tigers, and I'll say it again, proves that they are the number one team in the nation as they have beaten Alabama.